New York City made me buy it. Hey girl, welcome back to Stylish Milk. Today we are doing a shopping haul. So it's a pretty little package and I have three of them for you. Specifically for this upcoming trip to New York City, I am heading to the Big Apple for the very first time. I am incredibly excited. Um, I have a little bit of mom guilt. Uh, okay, a lot of mom guilt. And um, I'm excited because I'm shooting specifically for the next issue of Stylish Milk Magazine. Oh, it's going to be so incredibly special and meaningful and beautiful. And I can't wait to um, show it to you this September. So mark your calendar. September 10th is the, um, the date we're shooting for. So that aside, I'm heading to New York. I'm photographing um, two beautiful families while I'm there. And I'm doing several interviews for Stylish Milk TV. Um, it's a series called In the Social, and these are the most beautiful, inspiring women, and I cannot wait to share those videos with you. But for today, um, I had to do some shopping because it has been, um, let's see, Millie was six months old the last time I got on a plane and left. So she's almost 10. It's been a while. It's, it's been a long while. And so I needed luggage. I needed, um, you know, TSA approved travel accessories. Um, and I just needed some things that would make me feel really good, um, you know, personally. So I have three different bags to open, actually two bags in a box. Uh, so let's get started. First up is Sephora. I love Sephora. Uh, do I get to shop there very often? Nope, not very often. Um, so what I got, oh, Yes, I got the Funfetti Deluxe Collection. This packaging, can we just pause for a minute? And it's beautiful. The shimmer on the side. Girl, get out of here. Oh, you know I'm a sucker for pretty branding. All right, so we're going to rip this open. It says that it's a deluxe collection. And I love buying samples. Like, um... You know, the little sample kits that you can get, you don't spend as much money um, right off the bat when you're trying to figure out which brands you want to invest in. And so that's what I did here. So included, I get a long wear lip topper. I get an ultra foil liquid shimmer eye topper. And I get a Funfetti powder highlighter. Yes, 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 yes. Anything that can make you feel beautiful and shimmery is like all right in my book. I can't wait to try these while I'm in New York and try some glam looks because I tend to keep it neutral for my makeup uh, just because that's easier. I'm a mommy and I'm always on the go. I'm running out the door uh, last minute and I don't want to spend a whole bunch of time on my face, uh, but I do want to feel good. So um, yeah, let's give it up for the beautiful packaging. I'm so excited for that. Okay, next up is, um, there's a lot of buzz around this, this brand. Um, they claim that everything is a dollar and it's a makeup brand. I am not new to this brand. I'm actually a customer and this is probably like my fifth order ever, but we shopped Miss A. <laughs> it's here. Feel good. Oh, I feel good, girl. I do. Um, I love this because it's always um a dollar there are a few things that aren't a dollar um but more or less it's like package type of of things um but they claim to be supporting education uh cruelty free makeup um and feel good ingredients and they support animals so let's rip this baby open let's take a little bit of time to ship um that's like my only kind of flaw about them um but I will say this, it makes up for it when you spend $35, you get free shipping. And uh, sometimes they actually hold deals where it's free shipping no matter what you order. So I tend to keep an eye out for those. If there are some hits or misses with the makeup in this uh, category of being a dollar. So um, there are some things that I absolutely love and buy over and over and over. And then there are some things that I just threw away immediately because they did not work out. Um, so this specific haul, I'm not going to share everything I bought with you, um, because it's a lot <laughs> to get $35 worth of stuff. It's a lot, but I am going to open it up really fast. 
I'll be right back and I'll show you some specific things that I got for New York. Be right back. Back. It took me a little while to get through all of this. Um, they are fantastic about actually packaging safely. Um, they use lots of bubble wrap, a lot of styrofoam, um, and some things just to make sure with makeup especially, um, it can get broken in transit. Shop Miss A has no idea that I am recording this or that I bought anything. Um, they don't know who I am at all. <laughs> so I just love the, the brands and the company. I've had really great experiences with them. So I wanted to share that with you. Um, something that I order over and over and over again are the She lip glosses. I tend to gravitate towards nudes. Um, I'm wearing one today and I wanted to get a couple more uh, for my stash because I love them so much. Um, they are not long wearing, but they're not sticky and they're like really smooth when they apply. Um, they last a little bit of time, but it's not transfer proof. So I like them just as a quick grab on the way out to know that I'm not going to drink or kiss anybody and I put those on. Um, so that's what I use those for. And then another thing that I buy over and over and over is the AOA uh, contour stick. I love these for doing the uh, smaller contouring like around my nose or um, maybe a little bit on the cheek here um, and a little bit under my lip. Um, so I got some more of that. I am a huge LA Colors um, mascara girl, which might sound crazy because I know that I get these usually from uh, the Dollar Tree. Um, they are also a dollar here at shopmissa.com and I get them actually because I like to do a very small minimal base coat on my natural lashes before I go into the more expensive mascaras that I use. Um, I am in love with the beauty blenders. I get them every single time I order um, and I was due for them. Arlo, my sweet autistic baby, loves the sponges as well. And he likes to steal them so i'm always looking for more um and then i actually got a new wet dry brush because uh i needed to have something specific for my hair here um and yes you know that i wear wigs uh i will maybe tell you why one day but this is my real wig um, everything else is faux that you might see me wear um this is my real one this is my everyday wear one I love it. Oh, I love it so much. I can brush this one. I can style it. Um, I can do all of the fun things with it. So I got a brush specifically um, that I could use for this wig. Okay, are you ready? Um, I got myself a travel bottle kit. There's four of them. And um, it says that it is carry on size approved. It's travel approved. They're completely clear. So I'm excited to put some of my favorite beauty products that come in like the larger bottles or bags make sure that I get them in so I can take them to New York with me. And then finally, girl, it's pink and it's freaking adorable. Um, I'm going to pop this open for you. And I got some new brushes. So I am really bad about cleaning my brushes. I'm just going to admit that to everybody. Um, I don't do it very often. So what I do is I go to Shop Miss A and I stock up on brushes and they have some good selections. Not all brushes are created equal. Um, some aren't very good. So I do get the pack of brushes and then this is so cute. You can use it for so many different things afterwards. Um, so I kind of splurged a little bit on this purchase and got myself some new brushes. So yeah. Okay. Now that's it for this one for now. I got some new things that I'm excited to try too. Um, but I can't wait for this third unboxing. I and so giddy. It's not even funny. I am such a huge fan of her. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to admit that to you. I am almost 40 years old and I loved watching the Pretty Little Liars series. Um, I've tried watching the spinoff for that. Um, I don't know. I, I had to turn it off after a while. It just wasn't my cup of tea. But the original Pretty Little Liars, I was a huge fan. I loved it. Um, made me feel like I was a teen again. And so when I heard Shay Mitchell um, had started a travel type of a brand, I was excited to look into it. Um, so I needed new luggage anyway. Are you ready for this? <sighs> Let me get it. Ah, I was excited. Oh, yeah. Okay. First of all, though, I want to um, shout out to my girl, Jessica, who owns the Lola and Lulu Boutique in New York. Um, I'm wearing her tea today to celebrate, you know, going to New York and everything. But anyway, I've had this for a while and I have not been able to wear it because 
Um, I was always a little bit bigger, but I've been working out and watching my my diet and all of that so I could fit into it a little bit easier. So I was excited to put it on for the video today. I'm sorry I'm late. I didn't want to come. So true. So true. Okay, I'm going to be right back. <gasps> Let's rip open this baby. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's like Christmas morning, you guys. Okay, are you ready for this? Let's do it. Um, I ended up getting two luggage tags because I wasn't sure if I would be needing a one or two for these bags. So I got two. Um, get lost, find yourself, repeat. Is that not adorable? Um, let's rip open into the luggage tag. Yeah, okay, it's really, really pretty. And it's pink, so, you know, you know. You know, I had to buy it because it was pink, right? So I got two of those. This one is the backpack because I wanted something that I could travel um, and put my gear in but keep it like, under the seat with me because I want to keep an eye on it and make sure all of my camera gear and my film gear everything is like super great this is the backpack and it's canvas um, with the, the pleather type of um, outline it's really nice it's really kind of heavy and sturdy um, it has the padding on the back. It has, oh, this is really nice, you guys. So if you have the roller kit, she, she does have a roller luggage thing as well. But, um, so this can actually go over your, your luggage, um, and kind of keep everything together perfectly. Um, let's see what else. So there's a front pocket here. Oh, I like this a lot. You can kind of attach your keys if you want to. Um, there's lots of little pockets in here. And then there's, a uh, Gosh, there's two more zippers so it zips all the way down so you can actually have it completely open you have your uh, your tie down or whatever for your clothes um, the toiletries there's a mesh zipper bag here um, they do come with the cup holders on both sides I like that okay <sighs> I'm so excited you guys so excited okay and then a full huge opening back here with the zipper. Shay Mitchell, I see you. I'm very impressed so far. Very impressed. Okay, guys. So this is the Weekender. And you know, if you've ever seen anything online and you're just like, oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Um, is it going to be as pretty in person? Uh, yeah, I'd say it's pretty fantastic. Um, there are so many wonderful things about this bag already. I'm crazy excited. Um, I did decide to invest with Shay's company, uh, Base, I believe it's called, because I wanted to make sure that it had some travel features that I would find um, convenient. And one of them is this bottom zipper here. You can do shoes down here. Um, they have a zipper here. You have in the opening, um, you have all the extra handles that you need, which is fantastic. Um, what else? And then the inside is, there's a case for your laptop. Um, there's tons of room. It's, it's huge, you guys. Like, it's really big. And then you have, um, you have a zipper here as well. So if you want to do the, uh, over the, the suitcase thing, you can. Um, yeah. I will, of course, let you know what I think. I just knocked over all of my makeup. This shopping haul was fantastic. I loved everything that I got. Um, first impressions are up there. Uh, actually, when this airs on Stylish Milk TV, I will already be in New York. Make sure you follow on Instagram, um, at Stylish Milk TV, to see behind the scenes, because I'm going to be posting a lot. So anyway, I'm going to stop rambling. This was my shopping haul specifically for New York. And ah, can't wait to be a jet setter. I'll see you next time. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to show your support for me and all of the brands that you're seeing. And I will see you in the next video.